super, super, super zombie, zombie power. Hello, Zomrads. Happy Monday. And Happy New Year. Yeah, I know it's March. It's Persian New Year. Noruz is what it's called. Yesterday was the first day of spring, and it was also the first day of the Persian New Year because we're special and follow a different calendar. And besides, it's better to have New Year's in springtime when it's warm. <laughs> Now, unfortunately, I was at rehearsal when the year changed sometime around six or seven, but what you're supposed to do is set up a table called a half scene, and um, you put things on that table that represent various aspects of your wishes for the new year, like sib, which is apples, and seke, which I'm not sure what it is, seed, which is garlic, and some families, like my family, draw faces on the garlic, so we have one garlic for each member of the family, and then they have faces on them, and it's adorable, and I love doing that. And you're supposed to wear new clothes, and then you go and meet with your family and have a nice dinner and like gather and everything, and all the kids get money like on Chinese New Year. So it's a time to be with family and things, not a time to go get trash, like Western New Year. So before the New Year even starts, the Wednesday before the year changes, you go out and celebrate with friends and family out in the open, um, and it's called Char Shambe Suri, which means, I believe, Sour Wednesday, something to that effect. Um, and you jump over a bonfire with a friend slash family member, uh, you hold their hand, you jump over the fire while you say, Zadi man as to, to as man. Translates roughly to, my sickness and paleness to you and your health from the fire to me. So it's like a well wish for the other person as you jump over the fire. Yeah, we like fire, man, because Persians before the Arabs came used to be Zoroastrian, and we didn't worship fire, but we used it as a, as a vehicle for the gods to show themselves. And it's like, there's more to it, but I'm not even gonna pretend to know what I'm talking about. That's pretty much all I know. And there's also like a thing where you like take a blade of grass and tie it in a knot and like give it to the girl you like or something for men. We also have our own little version of like Santa Claus. I don't even know how else to explain it, but he's like this tiny little black man. And I don't mean black like African, I mean like black. This color, black. And he wears like this red traditional outfit thing and like a little fizz. And perfectly acceptable to put a Persian man in blackface to play Hajji Fumi. Because that's Iran, and it's not weird in Iran. Different cultures, different countries. Yeah. And there's like this character, and he is basically the Santa Claus of Virgin New Year. And he's got songs and little stories and adorable things that go along with him. One of the one of the songs associated with Haji Fidus is playing in the background right now. There's this fella named Faram Azza Asef who put out like a new Haji song every year for a while. Um, and they're all very funny and there's lots of different voices and characters and things. I'll link to whatever I can find on YouTube in the doobly-doo of these songs because they're kind of amusing even if you don't speak Farsi because of all the different costumes and the characters that he does. If you see a Persian friend of yours or something in school today or something like that, go and wish them a Happy New Year. They will be so happy that you knew that it was New Year's. I'm not even kidding because nobody around here knows what the hell I'm talking about most of the time. So, Aida Shomam Mobarak, and I will see you on Wednesday.